Hi guys, Justin here. Today I'm going to be taking a look at the Banshee SS and the Brass She from G Squared Yo-Yos. <laughs> This is the Banshee SS, and this is the Brass She. These are both identical designs made out of 6061 aluminum, with the Banshee SS having stainless steel rings, while the Brass She has the more dense brass rings, which add about a gram and a half all packed onto the rim. So I said a gram and a half, but after double checking, it's closer to 1.8 grams. These both use the G Square exclusive G19 pads which you can get from G-squared yo-yos. They are not the standard 19 millimeter. Both of these have really nice aesthetic cuts in them as well as a spike in the middle of the cup. I'm gonna string up both of these, take them through a few tricks and see how they contrast with one another. The music you're hearing in the background is by Timid. Check out his SoundCloud in the description below. On Cold Fusion to Kamikaze, on the first throw, the brass she definitely feels quite a bit heavier, more than the 1.8 gram difference. The brass she feels more powerful, but the Banshee SS feels lighter and more nimble. On Skin the Gerbil, the Banshee SS feels lighter and faster. Again, the Brass She is heavier, but it feels more stable. The Banshee SS may feel faster, but both of these can haul. On Bouncy Castle, both of these bounce really well, and while you can feel the weight of the brass, especially when moving on the string, it doesn't feel heavy, just heavier than the SS. The finish on these is excellent for grinds, and both of these are able to execute the trick with ease. For finger spins, without even landing on the spike, both of these are great finger spinners. Both of these execute horizontal with ease. Not much else to say. Here are my final thoughts on the Banshee SS and the Brass She from G Squared Yo-Yos. In terms of spin time for which one spins longer on the string, I have to give it up for the Brass She. When executing the same trick on both Yo-Yos, the Brass She spins longer and comes back to my hand with more force. For stability on the string, I would have to give the edge again to the Brass She. When the string touches the side of the Yo-Yo, the Brass She resists leaning more. Additionally, the brass she starts to lose spin a little bit more gracefully. For weight on the string, the Banshee SS feels significantly lighter on the string. Despite it only being 1.5 grams lighter, neither of them feel heavy, and the weight difference between them feels like it's a lot more than 1.5 grams. For gap width and response, I would say that these are both identical. They're identically designed, and I had no issues with either one of them. For movability on the string, the brass she was harder to maneuver quickly than the Banshee SS was. The Banshee SS is just a faster yo-yo. That said, the brass she is not difficult to move, nor is it a slow yo-yo. When you play them back to back, the Banshee SS just feels easier to move. For precision and catchability, these are both identically designed and identically catchable. On a personal note, I am a huge fan of both of these yo-yos, and I was surprised with how different they played despite looking identical. The 1.5 grams packed on the rims here really makes a big difference. So, in conclusion, if you own neither of them, which one should you buy? I would say if you want something faster and lighter, go with the Banshee SS. If you want something with a little bit more power and heft to it, pick up the Brass She. That said, I honestly don't think you can go wrong with either of these. I think that if you purchase either one of these, you'd be extremely happy. Second question is, if you own one, should you get the other? This is a tough answer. These are both premium yo-yos with a premium price tag and limited availability. If you do have a yo-yo preference based on speed or power, then I don't think you would get too much out of the other option. That said, if money is no option, which it is for most people, get both of them. 
I feel like they are different enough that you won't feel like you have an identical yo-yo. My personal preference is for the Banshee SS, but it is a slight preference. And I'm really happy to have both of these in my collection. Those are my thoughts on the Banshee SS and the Brass She from G-Squared Yo-Yos. If you have any questions or want me to compare any other yo-yos, please let me know in the comments below. Thanks for watching. See you next time.